Hey everybody, it's the Ancient Meddler, and I'm back again doing another reaction video for you guys today. So, uh, this, this is a little funny story. So, we're going to be doing a video from a band called Pentakill, which I had never heard of before. Uh, uh, someone in Second Life actually recommended that I check this out because I was talking about it. Hey, dude, have you ever heard of this band called Pentakill? You should listen to this song called Lightbringer. So, uh, here I am, and uh, I was going to do that this morning, and I actually made a video my first time hearing them never heard them before and uh my mic my mic was muted so you couldn't hear anything i said it was a great video though man it was awesome i said some really cool things i uh, wish i could remember them and yeah so i posted the video and then somebody in the comments said hey dude uh you might want to check that because your mic was like So here I am doing it again. Now, that's not the worst thing. The worst thing was after that, I went on and did another video of playthrough on the, the video game Manor Lords. I was going to go that and do a review on it. About an hour and a half worth of work completely was wasted because this mic was... I've been playing with my settings and setup on this thing, so I was trying to do some more stuff and, and add some filters in. Some, do something with voice meter. I played with that for a little while. I went back and... Doing that, I screwed it up. So you can see it's actually working this time. And uh, <laughs> so back to the band. So okay, this band's called Paint. The uh, band's called Penta Kill, and I'd never heard them up. So I looked them up on Wikipedia. It turns out they're the house band for Riot Games, and this is all part of the the game League of Legends, which I don't play. So I'm not familiar with this. I've never heard it before. Um. So yeah, I. So I listened to a studio version and a live version. And I really like the studio version, but I didn't like the live version much. So good thing is we're gonna do it again. I'm gonna listen to it and we're gonna we're gonna listen to the studio ver version for a little bit. Then I'm gonna switch over to a different live recording that maybe I'm gonna like more. There was something about that live recording that just didn't sound right. So I think it might have been the quality of the recording. I, I don't know. The the singer is was great in it but the band just didn't sound all that anyway so this is called lightbringer it's from a band pentakill and we're going to jump into it right now so let's let's uh let's check them out hopefully this one works better and you guys uh, let's check this out Far, I like it. I like that heavy. I'm going to back up over his vocals again. I apologize for cutting him off. So I just want to talk a little bit about that intro. So you got the one guitar. He's basically doing like, uh, it's almost kind of like scale. So, oh, okay. It's good. Um, and then the other guitar kicks in. The other lead kind of kicks in and plays more of a melody. So the two of them together, it, it sounds really good together. With the, the heaviness of that driving kind of sound is is good so i like that i like that. I like that so far i'm pleased with it then the guy's vocals kicked in and i really like it. that's the kind of that's the kind of power metal that i want. it's like i don't want somebody who's super shrill or uh all harsh vocals and i, I, don't know. I like i like it when the guy sings and he's got a, this guy's doing a great job so i like that i'm gonna back up a little bit listen to it Started. Of
like that transition right there, and then it became much more up tempo with the kind of uh, increase in tempo. I like that. I like the sound of it. So let's back up. I'm gonna jump into the live. I don't want to spend a lot of time on this because. Yeah. So I like that a lot. So before we get too far into that, I want to jump into it. So let's go over and check that out. This is Pentakill Lightbringer Live. The Finale de CBLOL 2017. I don't know. Ceremonia de Apertura. Apertura. I don't know what this is from. I don't know anything about it. Um, doesn't. It's not an official video. I hope it's not some crappy video. I haven't heard it at all jump in together check it out can't be worse than the one i heard before Confuses the uh, F. Uh, okay, I watched the other video and it wasn't like that. It was that one dude with the the one guy that came out that was standing there singing. That's the guy that sang the whole song. Who's the guy in the mask? And which one? Who sang the song? So uh, is I'm assuming that's some character from the video game that I don't know because I don't play the video game. But the dude that was singing is no longer singing, and it's the other guy with the mask on started singing, so I'm confused. But I can tell you, that's not the same band I watched in the other video, because the other video, the, the, the band was old. Like me old. Like 60s old. Like everybody in the band was old. And I assumed that this was just, that was who they were, all right? And then what I did notice when the guitar player was playing in the other video that I watched, he couldn't play that fluidly. This guy sounds like what it sounded like on the studio record so he's hitting all the notes he's hitting them at the right tempo at the right time and he's not breaking any notes and he's not skipping any notes. in the video that i watched the first time that that, that was not anywhere close to that this is much much than the one i saw in the first video in fact i'm i may go pull up that other video so to show you what i'm talking about in fact let's do that Do that while while you're sitting here watching me do it. Love me. And let's let's watch that. Just because I want to compare it, because I might be nuts. Right? I could be nuts. You could be telling me, ancient meddler, you don't know what you're talking about. Would not be the first time. All right, where's he at? That's the one we're watching. This one. All right, let's watch this. I one. am the light bringer. I like that part. I like the guy's voice. You hear that? That's that. You got that ding in the back, but you hear the bass. The bass sounds muddy. It's like the other bass was like, bah, nah, bah, nah. this bass is like, bah, nah. right? 
And there's no, there's no punch to it. I talked about how bad you can do it. You missed a note. It's all over the place. It's like his fingers can't keep up with it. It's just tick 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 It's like, hmm. He's he's picking the note when his finger isn't hitting the note to hold the string down hard enough, and it's dead. It's a dead note. And then when it's not a dead note, he's missed the note, skipped it because he couldn't keep up with it. So that was that guy. Now let's go back to this one, and I want to listen to that again. It's a keyboard. That's not a guitar. Even singing? Now let the heart begin. Yeah. He's singing that. What's this guy doing? Very confusing. It's very confusing to me because I don't know anything about this band. So I said, the one guy starts singing and his mouth doesn't seem to match the lyrics. So it looks like he's lip syncing or this video's off. It could just be that the video's off, right? I don't automatically assume it's lip syncing. Just could be, excuse me, it just could be that the video's off. Because he's standing there and he's like, it's not matching at all, right? And then that dude starts singing with a mic. And it sounds like the same voice to me, which is weird. And, so, and then that guy's not singing at all. And then, I mean, I understood it. I understand if they wanted to make it make it look like that big dude is singing, so he's pretending to sing while the other guy actually sings. Because I understand it's a virtual band; it's not a real band, right? So maybe that's the that's what they were going for. But then he ain't singing. So which one is actually singing, and or are they both singing? I don't know. I don't want to get hung up on it, but I like the song. I like the sound. I like the singing. I like everything, but it's like, I'm so confused. And yeah, I went back and listened to it. When you watch the other video, that guy couldn't hit the solo to save his life. And then listening to it again, I realized it's not even a solo. It's a keyboard solo. So, I don't know. I don't know. These two guys singing. Does it match? Does it match?
And that's some kind of League of Legends team or something? I don't even know. Some kind of League of Legends competitive nerd team. I don't know. They, they, I shouldn't call them. Millions of dollars. Win that, but okay. I'm so confused. I'm gonna. I'm just gonna go back to the video and watch this. Listen to the song because this. Is, somebody. Somebody needs to explain this to me because my brain can't handle it. Who's actually singing the song? Is either of those guys singing the song? Are both of those guys singing the song? Is one of the guys singing the song? I can't tell. Because half the time the one guy looks like he's supposed to be singing, his mouth and the music don't match. So I, but, but I think that's the guy from the other video who sang it. So, but I thought a couple times in that video that he looked like he might have been lip syncing. So I don't know. I don't know. Is he just an actor hired to look like a rock singer? I don't know. Anyway, let's go back and watch. Let's just go back. We'll just go back to this one. This one, I don't have to worry about who's doing what. I can just sound. My brain hurts. This is too confusing. Good song, too. Okay, then it goes into like this quiet interlude thing. So I want to go back. Just before the quiet part, there's a guitar solo. But in the video, there was no guitar. It was like, uh. And then right at the end of this, there's like a guitar solo thing in, there, in the video. I just, do I really need to go back and make fun of them? No, I don't want to go back and criticize their video. I don't like criticizing people. I don't like, I don't like doing that. So, okay. Point is, the live thing I don't think is very good. So let's not even go back to the live thing. Let's just stay on the studio because the live, I don't know what that is. It doesn't feel real. It doesn't feel legitimate. This is the, this is the biggest complaint, the biggest problem that I had with fake bands where it's, it's not a real band and then they go live and it's not a real band. And, and you pay good money to go see these things. I don't know if you pay money. Maybe they're free. I don't know. And then, and then it's like, that ain't real. It's not a real, this guy lip sync into a band and it ain't really a guy playing guitar because he can't play the freaking solo. So why play the song if you can't play the music? Right? So, okay. Uh, and so that's what I was expecting to see with some of these other bands, which I did in other videos. Uh, and then I was completely blown away when I found out that they actually had real musicians that played real music in them live. So I'm, I'm kind of, I'm kind of like not really... I don't, I don't know. I like the song. I think it's a great song on the studio version, but the live thing. 
Oh me. I'm not gonna go back. No, I wanna go back. Let's go back and look at this. I wanna Where's this at? It's Will you It's like one note for every four notes in the real solo. The real solo is like, he's like, it's like, what, dude? You can't play it. Why are you trying? Right there. Right there. That, that was the solo just before the quiet part, which we just heard over there, which was phenomenal in the studio version. And there is like, uh, somebody from a lounge band. And this seems canned. Let me hear you make some noise. He's a real singer. That guy is really singing. this what is that who would do that who would why would you even waste time why would you even waste any anything to go stand there and go that's what one guy's doing one guy's playing one note And the other guy's going, well, what? Or what? Oh, what? I don't know what. I'm playing. I'm just hitting some weird strings and making them stretch and doing bent notes and pull offs and uh, trying to make it sound like something. Right? Uh, okay, let's listen to what it sounded like on the studio version of that solo at the end of this quiet part. Two guitars, harmony, playing together with a melody. Well, well, well. Okay, you hear it? Okay, it's not the most complicated guitar solo ever, right? It's not even a solo. It's just, it's just, a, it's just a connecting little interlude thing but it's two guys playing two guitars and they're playing together and they're doing the same thing and it's and it sounds melodic and it sounds good and it's part it, it belongs together it fits together it sounds like music let's go back and check that out this is supposed to be the same thing That guy's playing right. That guy ain't. That guy's okay. That guy ain't. Yeah, you can tell he doesn't know what he's playing. The one dude's playing the right part. He's put the one. The one that I was saying he's playing one note. Okay, he's not playing one note, but he's playing the boom part, right? He's playing what sounds like the right thing. It's supposed to be this slow melodic thing with some trill going on. It's like a little bit of. And then the other guy's supposed to play the same notes at the same time. And he's all over the map. What the hell is he even playing? It doesn't sound like music. It just sounds like somebody's pulling their hair on a cat. So, okay. Yeah, all right. Enough said. One guitar player, you did all right. I'm not criticizing you. You did what you were supposed to do. And it reminds me of when my kid was taking Taekwondo. And he was in a tournament. He's a little kid. He's like five years old, four years old. And he was in a Taekwondo tournament. 
And, uh, you know, what do, what do you expect from a little kid, right? But he's out there, and they're supposed to be doing, I think they're supposed to be doing, like, uh, like kata kind of thing, where you just do the routine, right? You, you do this move, then that move, and then this move, then this move. And the other kid, was supposed to be doing the exact same thing, was, like, rolling on the ground, spinning and flipping and doing all this crazy stuff that doesn't look like anything. It doesn't look like, like uh, a kata at all. It's not. It's just... Go out there and do wild stuff, roll around, and and then that's what this reminds me of. Reminds me of that. Like the one guy is he's trying, he's playing, he's doing what he's supposed to do. And it, you know, and the other guy's like, Hey, I'm winging it. I I don't know this song. I don't know what I'm supposed to do, but I'm following your lead and you play no okay, I'll try to play that. And ah. Uh, that's what it reminds me of, and, the, and how distracting it is to the other guy who's going, dude, what the fuck? What the fuck are you playing, dude? That's what it felt like. Uh. Call down the reckoning, bring back hope and peace, restore our glory to live forever. Okay, he is the light bringer, and I'm the darkness bringer because that was a horrible reaction from me to to criticize these people in um, in front of them for playing, and I apologize for that. I don't mean to make fun of people. I don't want to make fun of. People. I just think it's it's wrong to be when you're professional musicians to come out and do something like that. it's just. I don't get it. I don't understand it the best they could come up with and maybe that guy i don't know who he is maybe he's like some famous musician that does really well maybe it was a bad day for him or maybe i'm stupid and that's how it's supposed to sound that's a very distinct possibility i could be a dumbass and i could be the one that doesn't know anything about music who hears that and thinks that doesn't sound good and everybody else is going oh my god that's amazing ancient meddler you're an idiot okay we're, we're gonna take away your license to react because you suck at this and if that's the case i should retire because if that was supposed to be good then i'm doing the wrong thing um as far as the studio version goes i like it i'm gonna put that on my playlist i want to hear that song again i'm gonna listen to more from these guys but i don't have very high expectations from them for their live performances because one it's not a real band and looks like in both of those videos, it's different people playing the instruments. Uh, because the one band was really old. And that band wasn't old, okay? And so, and that one band didn't have an Asian guy. And that guy had an Asian, that band had an Asian guy. It actually sounded like he could play guitar. So, ah, uh, part of me wants to say, give them, cut them. Part of me wants to cut them a ben the benefit of the doubt and say, okay, don't be so harsh on them because... Music's hard. Music's not easy. And to be able to get out there and do that takes a lot. And I, I kudos to any human being who can play a guitar well enough to get on stage in front of a crowded arena full of people and play. So more power to you for that, right? But at the same time, the other part of my, the other, you know, the angel and the demon, the other one is going, dude, what the hell? You're doing a professional concert and you're using... not such great players that day maybe that day maybe just that day the next night when you come he nailed that solo i i don't know i don't want to be negative i didn't create this channel to bash people and be negative so i don't want to do that but i have to be honest honest opinion is that sucks Live sucked. Except for the singing. The singing was good in the one video. But I don't even know. I don't know. Somebody help me. Somebody please tell me what's going on. 
Okay, please tell me in the comments what I was watching because I don't get it. Was it a mimicry of a concert? Was it, was it totally fake? Was it, was it supposed to be? Is it, is it a joke? Is it going to stick that I don't get that I was supposed to know, but I don't know? Like there's an inside joke and I'm not getting it? I don't understand it. So please let me know why I should ever possibly consider listening to them ever again live. Uh, or if you like them and you want me to listen to other songs from them, please let me know what it is while my phone is blowing up. And uh, we'll take it from there. So if you, if you like this video and you want to see more of it, please hit the like button and then subscribe so you can catch more of my great, wonderful <laughs> content. And if you, if you don't want to miss out, make sure you ring the notification bell so that you can find out when I post another one of these great videos, hopefully with my mic on so that you can actually hear what I say and the music, you know, it's tough. Life's tough. I screw up. I screwed up. I should have had it done right. I didn't do it right. So you can tell me I suck, right? But I'm not out on stage playing a song, pretending like I know what I'm doing. Anyway, that's that.